Hey everyone, it's Dash and Dink. Join me today and see if our AR continues to climb. We did really good yesterday, but every day is different. So stay tuned to the end of the video and find out if we get even closer to 100%. We'll see you then. All right, good morning everyone. Dash and Dink coming at you with another day of door dashing and Instacart. Uh, but we're going to DoorDash for this first segment this morning. I have a VA appointment at 10 o'clock, and then after that, we're going to go out for the lunch shift, and we'll throw both Instacart and DoorDash on. But we got our first order of the day. It's $5.53 to go 4.4 miles, I believe, um, and it's from Hardy's. So we are clear on the south end of town. We'll run up to Hardy's, grab this order, and get the day started. How's it going today? Good, I'm Daniel, I think. Yes, sir. Both of them? I All right. So. Yep. All right. Sounds good. Yeah. Thanks, guys. Yeah. Enjoy your day. You as well. <laughs> we'll see Yesterday was pretty darn nice. Yeah. As far as the weather. Yeah, it was. It was Pretty nice. I see it even scared a couple of people off the lake because there was a house. It scared me off. <laughs> <laughs> I, was, I went out on Saturday out to Lake Campbell and I didn't really catch anything. And I was going to go out yesterday and I was like, you know, I don't know. Well, what blows my mind is I talked to a buddy. He moved his house from Lake Itasca to Bemidji. Yeah. And he just got it out there day before yesterday. And he drilled a couple holes. There's only 14 inches, he said. Yeah, for them to put that little village up out there. I'm like. I wouldn't go around the little village. You know, this time of year, you're usually reaching for the extension on your auger and there's yeah. 14 inches. I'm yeah. like, whoa. All right, you guys have a good one. All right, everyone, we got the Hardy's order picked up and um, we're actually bringing this to the jail now. It's not for an inmate. <laughs> it's actually for one of the jailers. So we'll uh, we'll go in and hopefully we don't get chewed out for the camera. <laughs> we'll see you over there. What? All right, everybody, we were sitting in the mall parking lot, which is our favorite place to park. And um, I just received the second order of the day. It, it took about five minutes, probably. Sorry, we are gonna be dealing with sun again today. Um, I'm really gonna have to go try to find me a pair of clip-on sunglasses. Uh, it's $4 to go like 1.2 miles from Perkins. Um, I believe it said high pay order. I did take a screenshot, but we started the day at 96% AR. So I don't know where all these good orders are at, but we're going to run over and grab this Perkins. <laughs> All right, thank you so much. You Appreciate it. Yeah, you guys have a good one as well. Thank you. Uh, you have something made out of metal and broken, generally we can fix 
Hello. Hello. Must be Kayla. Yes. All right, Hi. there's that. Hi, how are you? <laughs> you guys enjoy your breakfast. Yeah. Have a great day. <laughs> All right, everyone, we got that Perkins order dropped off to Kayla and uh, her little guy. He seemed pretty excited about breakfast. And immediately, once I got back to the car, we received a 556, I think. Uh, no, 506, I'm sorry, 506 to go pick up an order from McDonald's. I didn't even look at the miles. I think it was seven point something. Um, but something I was gonna say is, I'm sure those of you who watch me and those of you who watch Dashing Across America, you've probably noticed in my videos that I also have been going up to the doors and saying, thank you for your order, enjoy your you know, McDonald's or whatever, and have a wonderful day. Well, yes, I have seen a few extra tips since starting that, but, the one thing that I have noticed is, since I started doing that for a long time, my customer rating was at the same spot. It was like 4.86 or something like that. And it stayed there for a long time. Like when I first started doing DoorDash, a lot of people, excuse me, a lot of people left ratings, customer ratings. And it seems like that's just kind of tapered off and nobody really does it, unless there may be a new customer or something like that. But the people that you deliver to all the time is just, they just know what to expect. Well, since I started doing that, I just looked today and my customer rating went from 4.86 to like, a week and a half ago it went up to 4.91 and now I'm sitting at 4.95 so more people have been leaving customer ratings and they've been leaving good ones five star ratings so um, there's got to be something to it so thank you Chuck and guys give it a try you might get extra tips you might get good star ratings so let's head over to McDonald's and we'll pick up this order Thank you so much. You have a great day. Yeah, you too. All right, Isaac, thank you for your order. I appreciate your business. Enjoy your McDonald's and have a wonderful day. Order is at the door. Thank you for your business. All right, everyone, we just got that McDonald's order dropped off for Isaac. Just past the house of one of my co-workers for Itasca State Park, so I know this road and this area very well. But we just received another order, completely backwards, about 50 cents a mile. It's for $6.85 and it's going like 12.8 miles, but we're a long ways away from Duncan. Uh, that's where we're gonna go pick up, but we're going clear to the east, southeast side of town. So let's head on over to Duncan. We'll pick up that order and we'll get this underway. All right, thank you. You have a wonderful day. Thank you, thank you. Yep, bye-bye. All right, everyone. Uh, we got the Duncan dropped off for Ashley. I had the camera on my chest, and I completely forgot to hit record. All right, everyone. I had to take a quick break because I had the uh, VA clinic appointments, and it took longer than I thought because I was establishing care. But... Um, I just got done, we just got out, it's like 12.08. Uh, 
So we can still get some of the lunch shift and I just received the first offer for the afternoon and it is $7.51. It was to go, I think like 4.1 miles or something like that. Um, and it's from Tapatios Mexican Restaurants. Order for Teresa. Okay. Awesome. All right. Thank you so much. You have a wonderful day. All right, everyone. Um, I am just leaving the mall parking lot, which is our favorite place to park. I did not receive another DoorDash order, but I put DoorDash on pause because I did receive an Instacart order. It is shopping for one person. It is for 17 items at Target. Uh, sorry, it's 19 items, 20 units. So one of those items, they, they want two. But we're gonna head over there now and we're gonna go do some shopping for somebody. Super soft, uh, 10 count, there we go. A five pound. Unsweetened cocoa powder. All right, we got the milk and we got the cream. All right, here's the cocktail peanuts. Then we need cashew halves and pieces. I need this stuff right here. 10.1 ounce. Bingo. Uh, original found item. Okay, we got that. Six. Is it this one? Somebody must be cleaning. Haha. -ha. Maybe it's in kitchen? Twenty minutes later. Blind as a bat. Oh, right there, right there, right there. All right, thank you.
right, we got our target order shopped. It took us almost the whole amount of time because I could not find stuff. I was being completely scatterbrained. Um, it's just heading over here about three blocks to an apartment building. I gotta take it to the second floor, so. I'm gonna try and do it in one trip. It's four bags and a big thing of paper towels, so I should be able to do it. If Chuck can do it, I can do it. How are you? Hi, good. How are you? I'm doing fine. Good. Got nice weather for this. Yeah, it's been for a change. beautiful couple of days. Yeah, can I just set it down right Sure, now? sure, Thank you bet. You. Well, I appreciate it. Uh, and you have a wonderful day. Thank, thank you. you. <laughs> All right, we got the order, the target order dropped off at the apartment building. I had to go up to the second floor. And then immediately when I was coming back down the stairs, we got another Instacart order, really good one. This one's for almost $23 or almost $24 at Walgreens and it's only for five items. It's three items, five units. So three items and two of those items, I'm getting two of the same thing. So we're gonna head on over to Walgreens. Let's, let's go get this money, man. This is, this is why I love doing Instacart orders. This is why I want Spark to come to our area <laughs> because you get some good orders. It's only one shop and deliver, so here we go. All right, so we need two of these. And Coke. Just regular old Coke. Alright, we need two of those. There you go. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm. Have a great day. Alright, I'm sure you guys saw the uh, shopping there. I, maybe not, I was kind of moving quickly, but um, <laughs> easy order. Two 12 packs of Coke, two 12 packs of Pepsi Zero, and a little thing of donuts. And we're just taking it, uh, says we're four minutes away, three minutes away. So this will be a nice, easy, quick 23 bucks. Well, in two orders, we made 40 bucks and we did it in less than an hour. <laughs> but we're gonna turn DoorDash back on here in a, right now, actually. But, uh, I can't take screenshots of those Instacart orders because they disappear so fast. I would have never got that one if I wouldn't have hit uh, accept right away, so. All right, we just made it back to the mall parking lot, which is our favorite place to park. But we got an order through DoorDash. It's $4.51 going like 1.2 or 1.7 miles from Arby's. So we're gonna head on over to Arby's. We're gonna grab that order. Hey, we had a really good run with the Instacart. Let's see if we can't get a couple of more uh, DoorDash orders under our belt before we call it a day. Okay, thank you. We got the order picked up for Amanda and it's going one mile. So, like I say, $4.51. It's not a lot, but it's better than two bucks a mile. <laughs> Oh, 
All right. Thank you, Amanda, for your order. I appreciate your business. I hope you enjoy your Arby's and have a wonderful day. All right, everyone. I'm gonna call it a day. It's just hard to get momentum after you've been at the clinic. <laughs> but, it was a productive way in a couple different, it was a productive day in a couple of different ways. Number one, we did not gain anything as far as our acceptance rate, but we did not get very many DoorDash orders today. We only had, I think, three, three or four this morning. Then I went to my uh, appointment and we had two or three this afternoon. So there wasn't much. So we're still sitting at 96%, but we did gain in the fact that we have a 4.95 customer rating once again. Um, I always dread my customer, customer rating going down because that one, if it gets too low, can deactivate you. Um, it was a productive day as far as Instacart is concerned. We had two shopping orders for Instacart. Both of them, one was from Target, one was from Walgreens. It was shopping for one person and a very limited number of items. Both orders together, we got $40.71 or something like that. I'll have the screenshot up, but both orders together took us an hour. So we made $40 in that hour. Awesome, awesome stuff. All in all, I think between Instacart and DoorDash, and you, you have to remember I'm out here doing both of them at the same time, so I gotta count the time together. But we're looking at about three and a half to four hours. So not a great day hourly, but without those two Instacart orders, it could have and would have been a lot worse. So we'll take it. I am headed to the store, I gotta grab a couple of things before I go home. I hope you all enjoyed uh, your day. It was absolutely gorgeous day here today. We are breaking records again when it comes to the temperatures in Northern Minnesota for January. So, thank you everyone for your support in this channel. Thank you for liking, subscribing, uh, commenting, sharing. I appreciate it. Um, I got comments today on yesterday's video. I've been answering comments. It's been a lot of fun. Um, we have some laughs. We share input. And uh, I just want to thank everyone for doing that. So We'll be back again tomorrow for another video. Until then, this is Dashing Dink saying until the next dash. Bye, everyone.